Days after protesters, most of them Muslim, went on a rampage in Malda and West Bengal, Chief Minister Mamta Banerjee has declared that there is no communal tension in her state. The Home Ministry has asked Ms. Banerjee's government to submit a report on the violence. The BJP has also accused Ms. Banerjee's Trinamool Congress of protecting those behind Sunday's violence. The Assembly polls are due later in Bengal this year, where almost 30% voters are Muslim. One of the things you repeatedly said in your inaugural address and today was that there was absolute peace and harmony in West Bengal. You also mentioned at least twice that there was no communal trouble in West Bengal. I have to ask you, given what happened in Kalia Chowk on Saturday... That's a different, that is BSF versus people, there is a struggle. It is not, state is involved in any matter. And this is not a communal program also. And no, that was misinformed, that what happened there. Yes, ma'am. Because yes, I know no, that there are some... You know, BSF ka sab hi uska sab thora chakra hua tha. That is not also within my party or state government or state police. We manage this situation. It is BSF and the local people. Monadipa Banerjee joins us now for more on this. Monadipa, the, the, the incident that took place uh, has been referred to extensively on social media. It's not been reported in the mainstream media in quite the same way. Uh, have we as journalists missed out, missed out on, on a larger story over here? Or is this entire incident being exaggerated? Certainly not being exaggerated, but from day one, what we have been questioning is was it a communal incident or was it a criminal incident? A point that the Chief Minister in a way confirms. And in this day of social media, you know, perhaps, uh, you know, uh, the politicians can take a lesson that if you don't speak up and tell us what is happening, or at least the official version of it, It'll, there'll be absolute mayhem on social media and all kinds of theories will emerge or will be discussed and will probably be you know, repeated so often that you start believing that that is the truth. The fact is, we don't really know what happened. Fact is, yes, there was an incident with the BSF, a vehicle that got stuck in that huge procession. On Sunday, there was an altercation between BSF and the people over there. And there are reports that somebody actually fired in the air. We don't know BSF or the protesters. And that is after which the processionists went on a rampage. What is also emerging, and this is something police sources are telling us, is that Kaliachok police station could well have been a target. And one of the rooms attacked and set on fire at the police station was the crime records room. So lots of criminal records have gone up in flames. So were some criminal elements using this whole procession to burn up records about themselves. Kaliachok, Malda, is a very sensitive place, border, big Muslim population, and most important, 90% of the fake currency entering the country from Bangladesh comes in through Malda. The NIA has been investigating and the situation is certainly very tense over there.